all of the living things around us, like microscopic protists, fungi, plants, and animals are called organisms. We can tell if something is an organism by looking at its needs and characteristics. All organisms need the same things to live and survive in their environment. Animals need water, food and nutrients and a place to live. They also need the gas, oxygen. Plants are organisms that produce their own food through the process of photosynthesis. To do this, plants need sunlight and a gas called carbon dioxide. Fungi are decomposers. They don't eat other organisms and they can't photosynthesize. They obtain energy by breaking down the remains of organisms and absorb organic compounds from the broken down remains. In doing so, fungi play an important role in nutrient cycling in ecosystems. From microscopic amoebas to giant blue whales, all organisms are made up of cells. Cells are the smallest units within an organism that can carry out life processes. They are often referred to as the building blocks of life. All organisms grow as they get older. When organisms grow, they usually get taller and heavier. As organisms get older, they develop to look a lot more like their parents. All organisms can reproduce. This means they are able to produce young of the same kind. An oak tree will produce seeds from which an oak sapling will emerge. A female zebra will give birth to a baby zebra that will grow and go on to reproduce new young of its own. Organisms also respond to changes around them. When an animal senses danger, it may respond by running away. Some plants open and close their leaves or flowers in response to the change from day to night. Many plants grow or bend in the direction of sunlight. Responding to changes around them helps all organisms to meet their needs and survive in their environment. See ya! Don't forget to subscribe!